Alrighty guys, so here's my K3L. Now I still have it in the number two reversed orientation. So when I took this out for a run, after I posted the video up on YouTube, I got a comment on it saying if saying if I want that number two dominant cord for the that the classic K3O has, I would have to add one, maybe two pieces of paper behind the the, the uh, diaphragms of one and number three. So that's what I'm gonna do. I have two pieces of paper, as you can see here. I'm gonna put the cushion ring over, like so. And then I'll finish it off with the diaphragm. Let's put this side on. This side's a little bit cleaner. So then, so then you can see right here, there's the paper. So we're gonna take that, put it right in. Fits in like fits in like a hot dam. Put the put the back cap on. Make sure it doesn't slide so you know that the so that way you know that the diaphragms are in properly. And just twist it to the correct orientation and keep twisting, keep twisting until you can see the until you can see right through it. Then at that point you can just start start putting bolts in. Like so. Now I'm going to be doing this with the number one as well as the number three. As you can see here, there are the diaphragms for the number three. And I got two pieces of paper as well. So I'm going to put this all together, put on my rig, and then we'll try it out and see how she sounds. Now first test I'm going to put with the number two facing forward. And then second time I'll do it like this again. We'll see how it sounds. Alrighty guys, so before I do the test, I right here here I have the K3L. I'm running the m manual valve, which turns out to be a three-quarter inch ball valve with a th six foot garden hose. Alrighty guys, so I have the K3L up on my car. I have 27 gallons running at 120 PSI. So before I do my run, I'm gonna see how loud it is. And as you can see, I'm at my normal testing site. And as you can hear, it's very quiet. The only thing that is making noise is my car, and that's idling. So, if I hit, it, hit it max, we'll see how loud this thing is. And it is currently about 52 degrees outside. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, so I got 117.4 decibels. It's pretty loud for a three chime. All right, time for a test run. <laughs> 